What kind of swag? They are good, y'all. <laughs> do I know you? I'm gonna have to pick the nickel up. Sugar free. I'm gonna do it. Am I gonna do it? I'm gonna do it. I'm, I'm done. What's up, OCC gang? I'm back with another video. You already know that. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I don't even know if you're gonna like the video yet, but go ahead and hit the like button anyway, because I'm about to do something crazy today. I am trying to eat for free today. Because in my last video, some people were like, um, it wasn't really that free. So I'm like, you know what? Today, I'm gonna show you guys my top couple ways. Eat free, get coffee free, what? This is just gonna be a free day, and I'm starting by going to one of my favorite places, Tijuana Flats. Okay, so yeah, to show you guys, I'm committed. I'm going in here without a purse, without anything. You have to have like zero pride to do some of these methods because I'm just gonna go in, no pride or anything, and I'm gonna show you that it's completely, completely possible to eat for free. Here we go. Just I'm in line, and it's my turn, and I'm just gonna order it like everybody else and see what happens. Order? Um, Erica. Erica. All right. What can I get you, Erica? Um, I have a coupon for the trio for free. Okay. Oh, yeah, girl, it's on us. I got it. I'll really? That's it? That's it? Yeah, it? that's it. That's it. I'll get it. Oh yeah. my gosh! Right. Yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> that was super easy. So now I guess I just wait. Okay, guys. So I did it, and I'm just waiting now for the food. There's people in here who are actually paying for their food. They even offered me a free drink for waiting. <laughs> I'd be lying if I said I wasn't paranoid. I'm waiting for free food. So they legit just brought the food out to the table. Let's open it and see what I actually was able to get for absolutely free. Okay, so like the first thing I'm gonna do is like look at this receipt and like, thank you Kylie. It just says enjoy. That was it. Okay, so I'm already like excited because there's two bags in the bag. Two bags in the bag. Okay, so this one is just like sauces and condiments. Cool, cool. Well, that's a lot of guac for free. Are you kidding me? That was free? Oh my gosh. Okay, and now there's like salsa and I don't know what that is, but I'm excited to try it. Okay, so in the other bag, it's just like a ton of chips and they are like really hot and fresh. So I guess that's what the trio is. You're getting like three of the sauces and then the bag of chips. This is actually amazing for free. I am super satisfied. Tijuana Flats, they definitely, wow. For free, this is like one of the best offers I've seen. Okay, so let's let's talk about what just happened really quickly. Um, it wasn't hard, it wasn't difficult, it wasn't embarrassing. I don't feel different. I didn't feel bad as a person. I didn't feel like I was less than any of the other customers. In fact, they treated me just as nice. I chose not to dine in because I didn't bring in any money and I would not have been able to leave a tip. So I just took my stuff and left. If you have a family, this would make a good family event to just go and everybody gets their, their free little trio and then you just take it home and make, make an event out of it. Okay, so I am at my next destination and it is Publix. Okay, so this is for all of you morning commuters. We're gonna go in Publix and we're gonna get free coffee. I don't know how many places do that. I know Trader, Trader Joe's does, well, at least the one in my town, and all of the Publixes that I've been to do. So. Let's see what I'm talking about. Here it is at my local Publix. This is the setup. If you want free coffee, here it is. It's always like this. You just come in, grab a cup. That's what I'm gonna do right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill that up real nice. And it was free and I'm free to go. There's nothing to do. There are no grocery store police coming after me. I will even stand here in the lobby and drink some of the coffee. It's hot. It's free, it's completely free. Okay, so that's it. No one cares. No one cares. Not one person is looking at me, but no one cares. Okay, so don't feel guilty about getting free. Sometimes it's what you need to do to spend less money. So, and if you have a kid, take them to the bakery so they can get a free cookie. Okay, so I'm leaving with my free coffee and it was absolutely free. And that was it. No one's coming after me. You can come do this every day. You can do it like multiple times per day. It really doesn't matter. 
Okay, so my next stop is the mall because I'm looking for free, free, free. And there's some stuff in the food court that I want to see if I can get for free. But I came into Sears because I got an email saying that I had $20 in free cash. And if you don't know what that is, it's just basically money that they give you for free. You don't have to do anything to earn it. So I'm going to look around and try to spend my free cash. Okay, so after looking at all of the shades, I did kind of decide on these especially for free I like them what y'all think so I'm back here in Sears living my best life when they told me I had $20 excuse me when they told me I had $20 in free cash I decided that since I was rich now um, I needed to look the part so I went and got some things off the rack but now that I'm balling <laughs> $20 <laughs> do I know you now that I'm rich I'm leaving all the little people behind. I'm, I think I'm going to get some of these $20 things like the glasses and let me see how much this costs. This is $24 so suddenly I'm feeling like I won't be getting this. Only one penny. Okay guys, so I actually ended up having to pay a penny. So we went over our budget by a penny but that's not really a big deal. It's still practically free. Okay, so I'm still in the mall and I'm headed to my next freebie. This kind of depresses me a little, like seeing the dogs like this, I mean, this is kind of depressing. And look at the ones back there in the cages, like on display. But this is like, I don't know, I could just be that person, but it really like tugs on my heartstrings to see them locked up like that, especially the older ones. The babies are usually kind of amused, but the older ones are like not here for it at all. Yeah. There's some cuties in here. The little ones are happy. <laughs> They're always so happy. Only when people come by, otherwise they look kind of sad. But when you come by and talk to them, they, they seem to get pretty excited. This one is staring out of the back like, is there another way out? <laughs> I don't know what he's looking at. at. That hole back there looking for an escape. I have a hard time visiting places like this because they look so unhappy. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here and go on to the next freebie. Hey cutie, I'm sorry you're in here like this. Huh. So I'm out of the puppy place and I'm on to my next destination. So I'm at TGI Fridays and I just got a menu and I have a coupon for a free appetizer just for signing up. Remember all of the links will be in the description box below. So let's look at the appetizers and see what we can get now. With the coupon, just remember it's free up to $8. Okay, so when you're looking at appetizers, here they are. Make sure if you want it to be completely free, don't get anything over $8 because the coupon is only going to cover $8 and then you'll end up paying for the rest. But this is, these are the choices and I think I'm going to go with the onion rings. Okay guys, so this part is extremely, extremely important. I want to make sure that you guys know this. If you come to a restaurant and we're doing this free challenge, and if you come to a restaurant and you cannot afford to tip, do not dine in. Okay, so I ordered my onion rings and at this point I'm kind of just waiting on them to come. So I guess that's it. It's kind of weird, but we'll see. That's it? Thank you. All free. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, so I just took the onion rings back into the car because like I said, we weren't gonna spend any money. So I wasn't gonna be able to tip the server. So I decided to just go in the car and bring these with me. Okay, so whoa, whoa, this is a lot of onion rings. Oh my gosh, and they're so golden brown crispy. Oh my gosh, I have to try one. Oh my goodness, it like just kind of crumbled as soon as I tasted it. Cause I'm gonna put this away. I'll save it and like share with people cause that's just too much for one person. But it was completely free. This one was completely free. So today I've seriously just spent a penny. Okay, so my next stop is gonna be Dairy Queen to get some ice cream. I can get a free blizzard according to the coupon on the app. So that's what I'm gonna try to do. Now, normally I would not be getting all of sweets or junk food guys don't crucify me like oh my gosh how are you getting so much junk I'm just showing you how you can you know make the most of your free stuff so don't judge please <laughs> but I am guilty of tasting it all because it is like it's pretty cool to be able to get all of this free stuff in a day so I am kind of tasting it 
Um, I have a coupon for the free small blizzard. Okay. So Reese's, please. Okay guys, so as you can see, my total was zero. So it was really that simple, as simple as downloading the app and redeeming the coupon. Okay, so I lost count of how many places we've been to today, but this is pretty cool. Another zero receipt, so that's pretty cool. So now I guess I just wait on the blizzard, which is cool. Yay, it's here. Thank you. So, that was quick. Um, I ordered it, it was here really quick. Um, this is the size of it, which I think this is a decent size. It's the small. I'm kind of tired of all of the junk today, so I don't know if I'll be showing any more free stuff today. Uh, let's play it by ear. I might pick this up tomorrow. Good morning! So it's day two of the free challenge or whatever we calling it. I'm at IHOP. I'm gonna put on my free shades that I got yesterday from Sears. And I'm about to go get me some free pancakes. Yes, I filled out an email. It basically said, just fill out this email, join our pancake club, blah, 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 blah. I did all of that and now I get a free stack of pancakes. So let's go. Oh my gosh, guys. So the plot just thickened. Let me tell you about it. Okay, so I'm here in IHOP and I felt a little bit guilty because I'm dining in and I know I told you guys don't dine in, but I'll explain to you why I'm dining in. I told my mom I was going to IHOP and she's like, oh, I want to come. And I'm like, no, mom, I'm eating for free. I'm just getting my free pancakes and I'm leaving. And she's like, well, I would enjoy your company. How can you say no when your mom wants your company? <laughs> So I'm like, Mom, you're going to mess up my challenge. I have to eat alone. I have to get my pancakes for free and leave. And she says, I'll take care of the tip. And then I, it got me thinking, like, if you want to go eat with friends, um, or you're going to eat alone, and your friends are like, oh, I want to come too. It's almost like genius to be like... Who's taking care of the tip? <laughs> no, but seriously, if you want if you want to go eat and your friends hear you and they're like, oh, you're going to TGI Fridays, you're going to IHOP, and you're like, yeah, but I didn't have enough money for the tip, so I'm not gonna dine in. And they're like, no, bro, like just come with us. We'll, we'll take care of the tip, man. Just come on. So just put your food on a separate ticket, and if they really agree to take care of the tip, and you know that they are stand-up people and they'll do it, it's like a win-win. You get to dine in. You don't have to do the tip. They'll do it. Okay guys, so this is it. This is the free stack of pancakes. It should have been a three stack, but I really could not stomach all of the bread. So I settled for a two stack. But if you get it, it'll be a three stack. It comes just like this. You pair it with your water and you're good to go. And for free, you can't really beat that. Three pancakes, butter, all the fixings for free. And it's not like you're having a third world experience. You still get to choose the condiments. Oh, including my water, which was free, and the short stack which was $5.79 and they took off the $5.79 you can see it says birthday receipt check closed please pay your server but there was sales tax I did not account for sales tax so not only do I owe the penny that I spent yesterday at Sears I now owe 41 cents from the sales tax of this meal so so far my total for two days is 42 cents what kind of um, a power it just says a free slush. It's the app coupon. A Powerade slush? Yeah. Uh, so a Powerade regular slush? I think it's at medium. Alright, please go forward. Thanks. Okay, so I just ordered my slush. It's supposed to be free. We'll see. Okay, so here's my receipt for the Powerade. It was free. You can see that zero, zero, zero. This is starting to be one of my favorite numbers. Um, here's the drink. It was a medium. It's a decent size. It's good. I mean, and for free, it's even better. So yeah, I think Sonic was a win. Okay, so it says completely free uptime any drink. I've like never seen this drink before, so I don't even know where to look. Okay, here's like energy drinks. Is this it? Okay, I guess they were saying any flavor. Duh, Erica. What are the flavors? Original? Original? Okay, so there's original with sugar and original sugar-free. I'm going to go with sugar-free. Okay, so now I'm just going to go take it to the register and pay for it. Boom! I'm done and it was completely free. Oh my gosh, guys. This is amazing. I cannot get over how much stuff is just straight up free. 
You see the price on these, the original price was $2.99. This is crazy. If you have a racetrack loyalty card or rewards, just get your free drink, seriously. And this has been on my app for days and I never thought to try it. But go ahead and try it. This is just free. Sugar free, it's actually good. Okay, so I'm pulling up at the Quigley House Quick Detour. Um, the Quigley House is a nonprofit organization that takes donations for the women and children's, battered women and children's shelter for people who are escaping domestic violence and abuse. So sometimes when I'm couponing or I'm in a neighborhood, anytime I'm passing by here, it's just a good time, especially if I did a little shopping or I still have groceries in my car. It's just a good, great time to um, come to the Quigley House and drop off some donations. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I did a bit of shopping yesterday and I didn't take the stuff out of my car. So I'll probably donate most of the laundry items because I'm sure they could use that at the shelter. Okay, so I'm just gonna sit it on the steps because like when you put it on the steps, they'll come out and get it. So if you're local and you're looking for somewhere to donate to, just bring it out here and sit it on the steps, they'll come get it. Okay, so now I'm pulling up to Captain D's. <laughs> this is not my typical place to eat, so this should be interesting. I have that coupon for signing up for something free, so we'll see how this goes. Um, I have the email coupon for a free appetizer or dessert. Yeah, besides the popper. Okay, so I just ordered the mozzarella sticks. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> Not my typical scene, but they might surprise me. I'm actually gonna taste these because. Okay, so that was it. Free, 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 Captain D's. Let's look and see what these mozzarella sticks look like. Ooh. Okay, so they're not big and like crazy looking like I thought they would be. I thought they were gonna be huge and nasty. They actually look pretty good. Okay, so story time. I misjudged this place. These mozzarella sticks are banging. They are good, y'all. <laughs> okay. I'm enjoying these mozzarella sticks. Like I said, I wasn't going to eat anything else, but these are actually good. These are actually really good. You know how you know when food is good and people start talking different? Am I talking to you? <laughs> okay, so easy peasy. I just filled out a form for Sally's Beauty Supply. It said free $5 just for filling out the form. So even though this wasn't on my list, Mm, it was nice and I'm gonna go try Okay guys, so I'm kind of just browsing trying to find different things I've looked in a couple different places But my eyes are kind of set on this section because the price points are like three dollars four dollars one dollar and Ta-da five dollars. So that would make it like super easy to spend that five dollar reward So I'm thinking that we'll just do something from this area Okay guys, so my total is 41 cents, so again, I find myself over budget. Same thing happened at IHOP, remember, our total was exactly 41 cents at IHOP, and here we are again with 41 cents. So not only did I spend a penny at Sears, and 41 cents at IHOP, now I'm at Sally spending 41 cents. So, I guess I have to find this change on the ground, or I lose the challenge. Okay, so here's another freebie. I feel good about this one. I'm just so sick of like going over budget like I'm seriously like out here looking for change on the ground like seriously because we went over budget and I'm not gonna lie to you guys if we said we're spending zero today we're spending zero okay guys next stop Panera okay so I'm looking at the menu right now and I'm trying to look for things that are close to three dollars because with fetch rewards I redeemed my points because when you sign up, you get $3 for free. So I'm sticking to the $3 because that's what they give you for free for signing up. So I'm just going to look for a pastry that's close to $3. I know, guys, I should not be looking for a pastry. But when I'm looking at the prices of everything here, um, the closest thing to the $3 is going to be like a pastry or something. So that's what I'm looking at. But then there are other things like coffees, lattes, and things that are to something. And whatever you don't spend, you can totally save. It's a gift card, so it's not like a coupon. This is like a real gift card. It's most recommended for that. 
Is there an upcharge for the cream cheese? Um, there is, but with the, with the cream cheese, it's 288. Perfect. Okay, yes, I'll do the cream cheese. Okay, guys, so if you do the cream cheese, you're still only coming in at 288. So we are now under budget. Does it count that we went over at Sally's and IHOP? Do you think we can like just kind of include this as staying under at Panera kind of takes up what we went over at Sally's? I don't know. If you think we can, just say it in the comments below. Okay, so because I used Fetch Rewards, this entire transaction was free for me and I still have a balance left over on my Panera card. So I think at Panera, I'm winning. Okay guys, it is day three of free. That rhymed. Okay, so it's day three of free and I'm at Chick-fil-A. I'm about to get some free Chick-fil-A. Am I tired of eating free food? No. Am I tired of eating free junk food? Yeah. But Chick-fil-A is more of a, I don't want to call it healthy, but it's a healthier alternative. Okay, basically with the Chick-fil-A, all it really was, um, was that I filled out, I signed up for Chick-fil-A emails or a club or whatever it was. And when I did that, they sent me a coupon for a free um, original or spicy sandwich. So that's what I'm going in to get right now. It's supposed to be totally free. And just like every other day on the challenge, I did not bring my purse in because it's supposed to be free. Let's see. Okay, as usual, Chick-fil-A is popping. It's always popping in Chick-fil-A. Okay, so right now I'm in line. It's almost my turn. Like, you can go in Chick-fil-A, and it can be a long line, and you literally have to wait for, like, 60 seconds. I mean, seriously, I'll probably be waiting for, like, all of, like, one minute. Just an original right here, right sandwich? Here, right here, right here. Just a sandwich? Yeah. Meal? Just a sandwich. And is this from here to go, ma'am? To go. Okay. Do you have the Chick-fil-A app? I do, one second. As you can see, my total is three eighty-five, and let's go ahead and give that coupon. Now I'm good. Okay, guys, check it out. Total came all the way down to zero, zero, zero. Our favorite number. Okay, so I got my ticket. My total is zero. It was like super easy and very fast. I promise I was not in the line for more than like sixty seconds. Chick Fil A is literally the best. Okay, so let's talk real quick. I lied, not on purpose, but I lied. I told y'all I filled out. Um, an email sign up survey something for Chick-fil-A that wasn't true to be honest what I did I forgot I've been doing so many surveys and stuff that I'm so used to saying oh I filled out I signed up for the email club or something like that that was not the case with Chick-fil-A with Chick-fil-A what I actually did oh my gosh that was so quick thank you it's here already that was so fast okay so wow I told you like by the time I ordered they gave me my receipt I'm sitting down trying to vlog this <laughs> The food is already out. So how did I get the free Chick-fil-A sandwich? Okay, it's really simple. What I do is like, if I'm walking in Chick-fil-A, or if a coworker goes to Chick-fil-A, or a family member goes to Chick-fil-A, I'm always like, hey, can I get your receipt? Because at the bottom of every Chick-fil-A receipt, there is a space for you to complete the survey to receive a free chicken sandwich. And most people just throw their receipts away, right? Um, if you do the survey, you just get a free chicken sandwich. Um, how often can you do it? I think you can do it like once every seven days. You have to definitely like look on the website for the rules. But all you do is go to the website that's on the receipt and you fill out the survey. It takes like two minutes, literally. It takes like two minutes. And then they just email you, here's your code, take it in Chick-fil-A, free sandwich. It's so easy. So if your coworker's like going to lunch and you're like, dang, I don't know what I'm going to do for lunch for the rest of the week. Look, they went to Chick-fil-A ask them yo can I get your receipt most likely they're gonna be like what do you want my receipt for here take it trash and if you are brave enough go into the break room get it out of the trash go into the parking lot of Chick-fil-A get it out of the trash whatever you have to do I mean if you're down to where you seriously don't have anything to eat and you're like broke 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 and you're like dang I'm sitting in my apartment like without food or I'm sleeping in my car without food then this is like the time for you to like lose your pride and like go into Chick-fil-A and kind of chill out for a while and if anyone leaves their receipt or anything like that and you know you gotta do what you gotta do when you're hungry or when you're on a budget so this is one of the easiest ways do the survey were they courteous was the service good yeah you went in there you know ask your friend if you use their survey was were they courteous was the service good I mean what if you have to do but this is one of the best free ways to eat because Chick-fil-A is the bomb Okay, so if you've never really eaten at Chick-fil-A, you don't know what their sandwiches and stuff are like, but they are like a dream. Like, I am not lying to you. Oh my gosh. And they come in this kind of like insulated bag. It keeps them all nice and toasty. 
so like sometimes like in the mornings like I'll just check my Chick-fil-A app before like if I'm planning to go get breakfast from somewhere else I'm like you know what let me just check the Chick-fil-A app because there's plenty of times that I've gotten on there and it's like oh you get free coffee this morning or oh you get a free breakfast minis or something and those are the best the minis are the best so check Chick-fil-A's app and definitely sign up and use these tips okay so it's getting like super late and i'm like i didn't find any change or any money so i'm walking out of the store and i saw a penny on the ground i got excited and now i think i see a nickel a i'm not sure what this is okay so just ignore ugh, all of the trash and stuff but in order to win this challenge i'm legit gonna have to pick this that's a nickel i'm gonna have to pick the nickel up and the penny okay so that at least puts me at six cents to work off my deficit from what I overspent. Okay guys, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired of chicken sandwiches and nachos. I'm tired of junk food. But in order to keep going with this free experiment, I'm going to one more place and that place is going to be Dunkin' Donuts. <laughs> but I'm gonna show you how you can get free coffee and a free donut, but I'm not gonna do the donut part, but I'll tell you how you can do the donut part, but I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm standing outside of Dunkin' Donuts with regrets. Should I go in, should I not? It's free, I'm going in. Okay, so basically this time I am getting a free coffee, and I'll explain exactly how you do that. Okay, so basically how it works is when you sign up for Dunkin' Donuts Rewards, you get like one free coffee. And then how you get the free donut is on every Dunkin' Donuts receipt, there's a survey at the bottom that says like, um, you know, how's the restaurant doing, whatever, whatever. You fill out the survey and they send you a free donut. So, well, they don't send you a free donut. You get a free donut. You take your receipt back in with the code that they give you on the phone. You give your receipt to the cashier and you get that free donut so it's pretty simple to get the free donut and the drink is super easy all you have to do is sign up for Dunkin Donuts rewards and the drink is free so that's really easy that means you can have the drink get your receipt from the free drink turn around do the survey get your free donut so that's the drink and a donut and that's what I'm gonna do but I'm skipping the donut I just I can't do anymore thank you very much okay so that was it it was really really easy do you see like um, my total is zero I just ordered it and that's that it says a free beverage is waiting for you when you register for the perks rewards program so that's the website that you would go to is ddperks.com okay and that's how you get the free beverage just register and it's free it's pretty easy and here's the thing with the donut it says tell us about today's visit at tellduncan.com and receive a free classic donut okay so sign up for the rewards at the DD perks website get your free coffee and when they print your coffee receipt then do the survey for the donut and boom free coffee free donut every time and here's the other thing if you're visiting the restaurant and you don't have a receipt to begin with like if you're brave enough like just go look for an extra receipt like someone else might have thrown theirs away look right there right there am I gonna do it am I gonna do it I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it for you guys boom two donuts because this person left their receipt now I have two donuts. Amazing how easy that was. Wait, I'm going back, I'm going back. There's probably tons of them down there, but I'm not that savage. My whole gangster has not kicked in yet. Okay, so even though I was savage enough to dig in there, I'm not savage enough to do it without washing my hands. Okay guys, so free drink, here it is. I'm good to go. Okay. I got my two receipts. Yes, I still got my trash can receipts. Yes, I did hit my hands with that hand sanitizer. Thank you very much. And washing my hands for all of you people who are going to ask and say something stupid in the comments. But the whole point of this video is to show the reality of life for some people. And oh, 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 hold on. Check it out. Check it out. Do you guys see what I see? Do you see what I see? Should I go for it? Should I go for it? I'm going to step my gangster up. Oh God, <laughs> I did it. So, if I were in the position where I like legit needed to eat, oh my gosh, look. Congratulations, a free beverage. Wow, 
but I wouldn't use that because that's somebody else's reward that they probably earn. So I'm just going to go ahead and put this back because that seems wrong. But anyway, <laughs> if I were in a desperate position, I would have found three free drinks. But because I am not that ruthless, I'm not going to take that person's reward. But these are free just for doing the survey. And no one has done the survey yet. If they throw the receipt away, they're not doing the survey. Okay, because you turn the receipt back in to get your donut. So obviously if they throw the receipt away, they don't plan on doing the survey. Okay guys, so I am finally finished. That is all the free I'm doing. That was three days of free. I had a good time. I hope you guys had a good time too. Thank you for rocking with me for all three days. Make sure you go get yourself some free stuff. Check the link in the description box below. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you want to see next. What do you want for free? Let me know. Thank you, thank you, thank you.